Ali, man. Yeah. Gee, isn't that crazy that I didn't know any of that story? Yeah. Where you been, man? I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I'm, dude, I'm nobody, man. Trust me. I mean, I, and I don't know why. Do you ever feel a lot of pressure to be super holy because you have that? Because you know what? Uh, I hope you don't take this the wrong way. Yeah. But you, you hear of priests who've had these profound pasts. Right. And they fall off the wagon yeah. um, at the height of their career. Right. I shouldn't say career. Right. They're apostolate. Yeah. Yeah. And, and God bless them. I mean, any of us are just as susceptible to that. It's just that we're not on a pedestal. Yeah. What's that been like for you? It has not been easy. I'll, I can say that for sure. Because mm. um, the pressure is definitely there. And I'm still human. <laughs> I'm not, I haven't crossed the finish line yet, right? Mm. Do I get tempted? Totally, right? Mm. Um, all that stuff. I live in a very material world, and I still struggle with, with all kinds of stuff. Yeah. Thank God for confession, right? Yeah. Um, so, yeah, that that's a terrifying thing for me. Because that one passage in Scripture, those who are given much, much is expected. I'm yeah. like, dang it. <laughs> I'm yeah. like, I've been given a lot, Lord. Um I think what helps me a lot is um, being in a religious community, mm. right? Although I do travel a lot, I'm very connected to the community. So I'm not just like going rogue and doing mm. my own thing. That is really important because okay. that's where you can get real dangerous, right? When you're yeah. just off and doing your own thing completely. Um, and then also just the whole like with the social media stuff that we have today, like I... You know, I got a Facebook thing and I post stuff on St. Joseph every day <laughs> so people can kind of keep in touch. I respond to people as much as I can. It's hard. Private messages and things like that. Um, so I'm not like some elusive hidden secret thing. You know, yeah. it's like everything is out there for everybody to see. Um, now, the first few years of my priesthood were the toughest. How so? Because I didn't know how to manage all that. You know what I mean? When people are inviting me to everything to speak, to do yeah, this. Yeah massive amounts of food being pushed in front of me and i'm like sure right i gained weight Did my you? prayer life suffered hmm. everything my sleep all of that and then about five years into my priesthood i said you know what if i have to upset people in their culture and say look i love you people but i can't eat all this i need to be back and done by 9 p.m yeah i need to pray i need to sleep yeah um they understand mm -hmm. right um and once i got that under control now it's like a smooth Cool. Machine, yeah. yeah, so. Hey, thanks so much for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment below letting us know what you thought about the video.